Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Matt, this is Matt and Sarah's World, and welcome back to Satisfactory. You are going dog slow. Why are you such a slow campaign belt? Better. Right, so, at, I've just unlocked the trains. So there you go, there's all the stuff for the trains. I haven't used or built any of them yet because I'm saving up materials for the other upgrade to get tier 6 I think it is awesome but um, obviously by doing that it has absolutely smooshed my reserves for these I need a thousand of them so I've still got loads of computers but I want to redo my base because I have all this room, I could easily build another one of these, but I'm not going to, because I has a plan, and basically I want to build another level up, so to do that, I need to make some stars, make some stairs, So if we have it going up here, because why not? Why not indeed? Do. <laughs> uh, you're not gonna fit. So what I need to do is get rid of you, put another corner job in, there you go, and then get one of these. <laughs> then what we can do is destruct these. Because unfortunately my facility isn't any longer isn't any well it's English. My facility isn't big enough anymore. So the first thing we do is do -do -do. So the first layer I'm going to have just as these, just so I've got lots of feeds for the materials. No, no, that won't do at all. See, I wish there was a way you could kind of like hold and just build like in a straight line, if that makes sense. Thank you. 
Uh huh. Coming to a problem, you see. Or have we? No, no, no. We don't want to be doing that. I can't connect them that way. Oh well. This isn't the matter. Because I'm actually running out of space downstairs and I want to redo everything because everything's just crossing over each other and causing nightmares. Are you gonna let me clip through you? Are you? You are. Good lad. Now, I am gonna have to put a roof on this. Excuse me. I hate it when it does that. It clicks off screen for no reason. But I, for the life of me, can't remember why that's there. It's effort and see what happens. Nothing. It's just there for the sake of being there. Well, why not? Because what the plan is, is to rebuild <coughs> my constructors and everything so that they're all in rows, if that makes sense. So that I can have it all neat and tidy, well not neat, necessarily neat and tidy, but I can fit more of that. Because I have roughly this same square footage downstairs. I think this might be a little bigger and then what I can do is have where they currently are on the second floor as like a gathering area so I can have all the materials coming down to where I need yeah, right let's see what Tom Fuller we can do here right so if I go if I build a constructor just so I've got production assembler, even not constructor, so I've got a rough idea. So, how tall it needs to be. So, walls, there we go. I think two is going to be enough. Two gonna be enough? No, two isn't gonna be enough. I'm gonna have to go three high. Is that gonna be enough? Uh, foundations. Oh, they've got even thinner ones now. Oh, how lovely! They actually have even thinner ones. Oh wow, that's gonna make life so much easier. Can't afford. I am out of concrete, which means I'm not gonna make these either, am I? No. Well, I'll be back in just a moment. Actually, why don't I just build constructors? Because I need a fuck ton of them. Um, how many constructors am I gonna need? I suppose the real question is how long is a piece of string? Assemblers, even not constructors. Is there control to stop the midline? these as close as they can physically fit. Come on. Snap. There we go.
because what I can then do is have row one feeding off into these to the edges. But yeah, you'll see. You'll see. You'll see. They'll all see. I'm not sure the controller actually does snap it. To be honest. Look at that lovely. Because I don't know how much space I'm going to need. Because each constructor. Uh, I think about this. So I want to store the material and I want to obviously use it for other things. So if I were to assemble. that that means for example if I was to have this one making rotors and this one's making statters I can then feed them both directly into here to make motors if that makes sense and then obviously that would feed off and go back downstairs to store them all you see it <laughs> alright let's I need to get some more Concrete, which I should have an absolute button. But what I'll also do is downstairs, because I can get some more of these up here. I could fit at least one more in. Possibly, if I deconstruct them, I could fit another two. Because they take forever and ever and ever and ever. Uh, first floor work. But it means all my materials are together. So similar to how here. Like all the resources are gathering to here. But it would be a case of. Oh you're not gaining very much at all are you? What are you being used for then? Um, I think I know. They're going into like the beams and stuff, aren't they? Where's the beams? Where is the beams? What's that being built upstairs? There we go. Yeah. So you've got a hundred, which I'm stealing. I, mean, I probably have shed loads more scattered around, but yeah, this is just an absolute mess. Because obviously the game still isn't finished, but obviously they were just adding more and more bits on, so I have no fuel on me. That's not right. So my jetpack's not refilling. That's not right at all. Nope. And I've got a put ton of concrete in here. Right, let's take all of the concrete. Are you seriously telling me I have like no fuel just kicking around anywhere? Aha! Yeah, I'm storing other things up here as well, which isn't ideal because it means all my resources are all over my base. And to be honest, I have to wait before I can do anything else now, anyway, because I've got to um, let everything build up. And then obviously, I've already got one power line up here, which you can make off into more. Don't have that banded. 
Tools. Yeah. I mean, I would just tear this place down and completely rebuild it. But. Oh, for God's sake, seriously. So I think this is the best part of the game. <laughs> well, you don't get me wrong, it's nice to do research and find out new things and what have you, but building a base that actually works, if that makes sense. Yeah, I think I've actually gone too far. Okay, I'm just want to do enough so I can get my radio tower back in. Because then I can always just finish this bit off later. The fun bit's going to be trying to work out um, what I actually need. If that makes sense, how many constructors and stuff I'm going to actually need. <laughs> I think the best thing is just going to be to write everything down, go through, go through the list, go through the building list of materials you can make and see what you actually need because obviously the ideal is to build everything and then if some random achievement or new thing gets added you can just go straight away. Stop building them in random places. <laughs> uh, to be fair, I think that's probably going to be enough. I just want a couple of... Are you going to let me build them on top? There we go. I think I did it with four last time. Then what we'll do is we'll get the big ones. Come on. There we go. Come on. Give it that bit of extra height. Now well, let's build our radio tower back. <laughs> and of course, I still don't have power up here, <laughs> so I'll have to get power up here somehow. Uh, D D D. An organisation, yeah, radio tower. There we go. That big bitch. <laughs> So for now, I think the easiest way to do it is going to be like that, and then like that. Right, let's get rid of these excess ones that just randomly appeared out of nowhere while I was building. Yeah, you see what I mean? The square footage of this is actually huge, so there's no reason why I can't do it. I just need to power these. Now, Q, do, 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 power. What do I need to make the Mark III? Which, 10 power connectors. Oh, I need a chip for that. Okay, so if I 
combine that to one pick up some of those chips because I'm definitely going to need some of those <laughs> the amount of constructors and stuff I'm going to need I might as well when I'm down there pick up and figure out how much I need um, do, 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 do. see because where did I build them I think they're in my garage oh yeah it's garage darling we all have a garage I don't know where that came from. <laughs> dee, dee, dee. Ow. That hurt. I shoot your ass. I believe. It's, is it in here? Because then I built them down here. So far, did I put them? More concrete. Definitely gonna need that for later. No. So connectors. <coughs> I need to get some connectors, which I do have. I built like a, I made like 170 of them last time. The only question is, where did I put them? Because I thought they were in this lot somewhere. Nope. Where are you? No. Uh, nope. 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 No. Definitely not in those, definitely not in that. So, it must be upstairs. Because I know I built loads last time. There, oh, it's only 75 on there, it's okay. I thought I made more than that. Whoa, missed it. There we go. Stairs are rising at the moment. Of course they are. Looks like I did the same trick with that one as well. Just clipped it through the floor. Right. One. Okay, so. These can power 10 devices. Come on. I want you as close to the edge as I can get. Right. You can't afford. There we go. So you can power 10. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So there's 7 here. Stop clicking off screen, please. Okay, so that's eight. So if I were to put, say, one here, and then one here. Theoretically, that should be plenty. <laughs> so, 
So, I need to work out how many of these bloody things I actually need. So, anything that requires two items to make. Okay, let's go through you. Let's figure this out. Right. Where's the pen? I don't have a pen. for sign plate so one I don't need to worry about those because they're all being done down the side of the road so two Mercury frame three power shards steel ingots that will be taken care of downstairs steel beams steel pipes industrial beams Four. Stator. Five. Motor. Six. Heavy frame will be done by a thing. Spectre bulb. Biomass. Plastic. Fuel. Rubber. Circuit boards. Seven. Computers. Decent. Quick wire. Fabric. Fabric. AI limiter nine. That needs three. That needs three. Cartridge ten. Black powder, but what do you need? Coal and sulfur. Okay, eleven. Quartz oscillator. Silica, raw quartz, I can make silica, that's brand new, that's brand new, so, two, no, five, ten, eleven, and I already have eight, <laughs> oh dear. So yeah, I might have over overthought something I actually need. Right, let's get some quartz. I think I've got some kicking around on one of these. Do I actually have quartz on me? Right. So we must have some quartz somewhere. So I don't really want to run back down and have to run all the way back up. But I'm gonna to have to. Is there any of these? No. No. So, let's go to my quartz farm and see what we can do. What we can do indeed. Because you're making DJ flip. So you're raw, aren't you? I don't think I need a hundred. But I'll, I'll take a hundred anyway. Because that makes it, cause yeah, I want to get rid of all these like stupidly long lengths. And um, obviously eventually replace them with trains and trams and all that kind of thing. The only thing I might keep the same is the coal. Because obviously that's like perpetually powering those because one coal line at the moment is powering all three of those which obviously is always a good thing because more power is what's needed so let's make some silica see what's going on here does that open up anything 
Are you going to have unlocked anything in here? No, what do I use silica for then? Or was that just recently added for no purpose? From quartz, commonly used as structural materials and microelectronics. So yeah, I've got a feeling that's going to become either that one might be in the next tier, potentially. But yeah, false alarm, nothing new there, unfortunately. Right, so... 5, 10, 11, and I've already got 8 up there. So it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Then again, I need to redo down there anyway. Because um, I've got like all the Candesian stuff. And um, no, I've got some stuff outside as well, which I want to bring inside. So. If we configure you to make motors, you need status and rotors. So four, five. It's not quite what I'm going to do. F. So if I go splitters, logistics, conveyor splitter, so you can go into there. Too close, basically. F. So, right. <sighs> How am I going to do this so that they can go across there? So, I have to put a splitter in it anyway. Control. Oh no, that's only because it's um, on there, okay. We need an iron rod to do that, that's quite annoying. Right, anyway, so let's... Build some So if I put you there, that should be if I actually put you the right way around, might be a good thing. Some Oh, 
or the other option is to do it that way and then have you come over to that. <coughs> it means yes, I'm going to have lots of rails overlapping. But So what do you need as a material? The steel pipe wire. So yeah, this is to this one. Okay. <laughs> right, let's set up stairs first before we start worrying about where the material is going to come from and where they're going to go and blah 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 blah. Okay, are there any others that need... Let me try and think. Two into ones. Circuit boards. No, that's an easy one. Because circuit boards and crystal should be cartridges. See, Novelist takes three, so I can't really make those. So, a one is are two. So there are two into one, so you need circuit boards. The AI limiter is too... Yeah, but it's not too true, is it? Because it's... Do I need circuit boards for other things as well? Ah! This isn't easy. need to go, if that makes sense, for storage, so there will just be loads of these along the back of the building, well back and sides and wherever, but I think I'm just going to have to completely redo this, uh, right, I'll have to change this as well because that'll have to go right downstairs. But I could just watch it onto a thing and move it down. Um, right, anyway. The only thing I'm going to have to keep up here is the oil, oil based stuff. But yes. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying it so far. I certainly am. And um, yeah, hopefully when I see you again, I'll have finished all this and I won't have to bore you with going through it all. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.